Hello my wonderful necromancers, it's time for another devlog. Since the last video, almost all of my efforts have gone into making the new campaign mode, which is significantly more work than the battle mode, because I need to do cinematics and think up story stuff and all kinds of things like that. I've also been improving the sound effects and the hood, so hang around until the end of the video to see some battle mode gameplay. The first necromancy faction on offer for campaign mode are the cultists of Sahanek, who get their powers through the cosmic evil entity they worship. The cultists specialize in fleshcraft and the construction of truly hideous and horrific undead that mimic the shapes and forms of the creatures native to Sahanek's realm. How it works is they create an undead construct in the form of one of those creatures, then it is able to slip into this empty vessel and manifest in the world. In addition to these monstrous undead types, they also utilize zombies and mummies. If you read the faction description text, you'll get a better idea of who they are. The other option is the Frigid Cabal. This faction is more of a traditional undead faction because it makes use of skeletons and zombies and doesn't dabble in fleshcraft. With this faction you'll be having legions of armored skeletons as well as some large undead like zombie ogres. The skeletons are the predominant feature of this faction's armies. Unlike the cultist Sahanek, the Frigid Cabal derives its power from the scientific pursuit of necrotic magic. They seek out dusty tomes, ancient scrolls, and that type of thing. The upper echelons of the Frigid Cabal consist of some very powerful living master necromancers, as well as those who have transcended their mortal forms and gone on to become vampires, liches, revenants, and more. Read the faction text to get more information about them. The first mission of the Frigid Cabal campaign has you bound for an island of gnomes to destroy them and take control of the island. Or at least, that's what your superiors in the Frigid Cabal would have you believe. The island is ancient and strange, and full of secrets for an inquisitive player to uncover. I'm working on getting this boat ride to the island to be more cinematic and interesting, as well as the cinematic where you receive your orders from the Cabal at their headquarters before you appear on the boat. The gnomes are as tough as they are annoying, and have the advantage over the player. To tip the scales, the player will need to find ways to weaken the gnomes and increase their own power. Initially, all you have to work with are the skeletal gnomes from the graveyard nearby, which alone aren't going to be able to defeat the gnomes. Every time you kill things, you claim their body parts as fuel to reanimate more minions with. If you allow your fuel to reach zero, then the undead will no longer spawn. Fortunately, there is a lot of biomass available on the island. There are the gnomes livestock like sheep and chickens, which can be slain, as well as wild creatures like wolves. The wildlife can also be used to advantage because they are hostile to the gnomes as well. I spent a lot of time making the chicken and sheep AI, and even made a little demo scene with a camera that follows the chicken around to ensure that it works properly. The chicken will roam randomly within its little area, and chicks will follow their mother. If a hostile creature like a wolf appears, the chickens will run wildly in any direction they can to get away. Once they finally do get away, they will make their way back home. Alright, that does it for the campaign mode. Let's check out the battle mode. So, as before, there are two factions and two colors to choose from. Robots have seen the most improvements lately because I've been in the mood for machine guns and explosions. I was able to get some really nice gunfire sound effects and new explosion animations. There's also a nice weather system now that makes it snow or rain periodically. Anyway, enjoy the show and thanks for watching. If you want to help me make this game, please consider becoming a patron. This will help me purchase assets to use in the game. All patrons will be listed in the game's credits because they are directly contributing to its development. Master Necromancer patrons will have access to the alpha and beta versions of the game once the game has developed enough. I want to at least have one campaign mission finished and fix the current bugs in the battle mode before I release an alpha for you to try. But one will be coming, don't worry. The robots have landed on this planet. They will conquer it by force. Rival robot faction detected. Alert! Alert! Hostile life forms approaching the base. They must be destroyed. Yes! 
destroy the enemy base. The robots do not take prisoners. Leave none alive. Kill.
life on this planet will be extinguished by the necromancers. These grave robbers are amateurs. We will show them the true power of our craft. Hostile creatures threaten the Nexus. Prepare for combat. Kill them all. Amateurs, we will show them the true power of our craft. Hostile creatures threaten the Nexus. Prepare for combat. Kill them all. Another to add to the pot. 